Start by taking the clay of your choice and rolling it into a ball. We're using the air dry model magic. And it's already the color of hot dogs, so we don't have to paint it. Once you've rolled it into a ball, you can take your finger and roll it out to a hot dog shape. Roll it out evenly so it doesn't have a wonky shape to it. Mine are right under two inches. Now take your hot dog and carefully mark the ends. You don't want to hold it too tight or you'll squeeze your hot dog before it dries. You'll need eight to 10 for a hot dog package and maybe even a few extras. Let your clay completely dry before you try to bag it. You can use regular Ziploc bags or you can use these smaller jewelry bags. Either way, you should be able to make it the right size for your hot dogs. Stick four to five in at a time and then seal the bag. If your bag has extra room in it like mine does, push all your hot dogs to one corner. Get them as even as possible. Doing one side at a time, cover your extra space with parchment paper and heat seal it. You can use an iron and it only takes two to three seconds. Repeat this process on the other side and you will have made your bag the perfect size for your hot dogs. Cut off the excess and you've made the perfect package. You can also take a red marker or a pen and draw the line on the package. Apply double-sided tape to one of the hot dog packages so when you stack it, they don't slide. This is optional, but you can also cover your package with a label. You can find a label in a store circular, or you can use the printables found on our blog. Just wrap the label around the hot dogs and your wiener package is complete. Now your dolls can fully stock their grocery stores and they're ready for any backyard barbecue. Give this video a thumbs up if you want to see us grill the hot dogs. We want to give a shout out to everyone that asked for hot dogs. Thanks for the request and just craft it.